Well, believe it or not, Zach, okay, I've been a good guy for a very, very long time. I would love to have a Darth Vader uh, costume, but I, I, don't, I don't do well with things over my face. I have a hard time breathing. I guess that's why the mask is so fun to wear these days. But uh, yeah, I would like to do like a generic Sith, but without a, uh, a face mask. But maybe to incorporate the fact that I wear glasses, like maybe a visor or something like that, you know, to incorporate with um, wearing glasses. So, because you don't see a Jedi wearing glasses now, do you? No. So, no. <laughs> <laughs> so they all so have contacts get, and LASIK. <laughs> yeah. So, I, unfortunately, I have to do that. But uh, uh, if I had all pretty much all the money, I would probably do a Seth and um, kind of like a, a mixture between a samurai Sith type look with the Hakama and you know that sort of thing and maybe a little bit of the armor and then that, that's kind of like something that I would like to do. Okay. And Cheryl? Um, yeah, I don't I, I'm, I do the ones that I like already. I don't really have anything more than that. Okay. All right. Um, I'm running out of question ideas. Um, I guess a good question would be, what, it, what projects are you working on now? I know, Chuck, you mentioned a, tr- a Togruta. Yes. So what, what is everybody working on? Uh, well, <laughs> yeah, I'm working on Audra's costume for her Jedi, uh, finishing up um, my Mandalorian, and working on a couple of commissions. <laughs> on some helmets and stuff so yeah i got lots of stuff i'm trying to get wrapped up um something that i'd like to get uh get to working on is i started printing this helmet is a odin costume Mm. um i've got the helmet part but i gotta finish doing the horns and the and the rest of it um but that's something you know down the line a little bit but (laughs) okay uh audra chuck is my costume oh, okay. <laughs> okay um all i do is i come in and uh I, I i do i follow my dream I, I i do whatever my whatever i makes me happy that day i'm making <laughs> can koozies this week Oh, okay. These are my Jack and cool. Sally. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Cool. I like those. <laughs> I made this one for my sister because her husband is a fisherman. So. I'm just, you know, if it, if it makes me happy, I do it. <laughs> okay. And, you know. I just need something to where I don't have to think after spending 12 hours in a 911 center. <laughs> okay. Uh, Cheryl? Sorry, I missed something there. What was that? Uh, uh, what, uh, uh, what, <laughs> what, what cosplays are you currently working on or would like to work on? Oh, no. I'm good. If I think of something, I'll, I don't. Yeah, I don't. Um, I don't know if there's anything else that I would want to do right now. Um, no, I can't think of any. Okay. Uh, Daniel? Um, Chuck is helping me on a heavy bando as Visa. Um, I've got the gun done. He helped me with the armor, the chest plate armor. And I've got everything else. I just need to get on it. I, I need a, I, um, oh, the flak vest. I need a flak vest for it. Um, but, and, and I've got hits from the Mandalorian Mercs for my pink Mandalorian that I've got to work on. Um, 
but yeah, that, that's about it for me. How okay. about you, Gray Loan? What are you working on? Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm alive. I am working on an emergency Mando. I just found out that someone is not going to Pensacon because she thinks she's not going to have time to get her stuff together. And I hate to tell her it'll be done tomorrow. So, mm. yeah, I'm working on her collector and her phone pouch and her, her comma bell. Mm. No, Co uh, yeah, her comma bell, excuse me. Okay, cool. All right, Alan, what are you working on? Or would like to work on well well okay well I, I could just be honest i mean you know it's all about a geek thing so uh uh not technically a cosplay but actually cosplay involved uh me and zach is actually writing producing and choreographing a lightsaber demo coming up next friday night and uh so that's been fun to do and uh zach's been in theater so him and I have been working together, tag team in this. So I've actually been enjoying that. So that's what I've been working on. What time next Friday night? Because I'm recording. Huh? What What's time that? next Friday night? Uh, I, uh, it's it's going to be, uh, it's at, uh, I, I'd have to send you the, um, the info on it, Daniel, but um, um I think we're going to have it recorded and everything. And uh, um, I'll see if I can uh, get you a copy or something or let you know more about it. You might, you and the, you and the wife and the kids might want to come up to it. It's a, a Star Wars family night and um, there's going to be food, the movie, uh, a new hope's going to be playing and it's free. Oh, wow. That sounds like fun. You don't have a time. Uh, I do have a time. I think it's six 30. Next Friday night. Uh, Zach, do you remember? I, I actually got it um, in my phone. So. I, I do not remember the name of the place, no. It's in Churchland, um, Daniel. I'd have to get you the info on it. I, I just got more uh, info myself tonight. Oh, awesome. But yeah, it's free to the public. Uh, uh, it's basically their celebration for May the 4th, and it's for the... Uh, um, the Masons, uh, the the Masonic Temple of Churchland, uh, is, and uh, is it at the Masonic Temple? Uh, yeah, it's the one in Churchland. It's right there beside the one Aldi. Cedar Lane. I think so. It's right there beside the Aldi, the Aldis. I'm near the Aldi. Yes, ma'am. No, that's. No, I'm. Tr I thought I'm trying to think. I thought there was maybe I'm thinking it's maybe it's something else that's on Cedar Lane by the um li public library. No, no, it's not that far. Matter of fact, if you know where the old Churchland High School used to be, it's in that shopping center. No, no, no. But I ain't gonna bore the rest of the group over something that's local. But yeah, that's <laughs> that's that's uh. <laughs> go ahead dear I'll fi we'll figure it out okay we'll yeah. figure it out yeah yeah i'll send you all the information for sure but yeah me Is and zach high street yes then yeah it's on high street okay yeah um i mean i I'm, I'm on the road i'm looking around and i can't place it but that's okay so uh it's okay yeah we'll figure it out okay dollar but yeah that's what me and zach's working on and uh um they actually are doing some pretty cool stuff him and uh, a few other guys so i'm kind of the storyteller you know that sort of thing but um that, mm -hmm. and all of us are wearing cosplay of some sort so it's pretty going to be pretty good take some pictures and um maybe i can put uh maybe with uh, zach's editing we can actually uh, put it on the Tidewater Cosplayers uh, page and let y'all view it. If you don't get there, maybe we can also put it on and let your members see it as well. There's Troop Around the Park tomorrow, too, at Oak Grove Lake Park starting at 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. It's it's like uh, instead of Tidewater Comic-Con, uh -huh. 
it's troop around the park. Yeah, unfortunately, I got. Unfortunately, I'm teaching and we have a rehearsal tomorrow, so that's the only problem. <laughs> okay, we can get back to you, Zach. Sorry. Um, I'm kind of at a loss of questions. Um, I haven't been able to think of another one yet. Um, does anyone have anything in in particular that they'd like to talk about or, you know, promote or anything like that? I make stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Since this is a recording, you want to put your information in so people can contact you or you got too much stuff on your plate? Uh, I got all kinds of stuff. Um, I run Grey Lounge Place on Etsy and I do flak vests and leather work. And yes, I can do your flak vest. Get with me later. Oh. Um, I do plus sizes, petites, men's, women's, flight suits, two-piece, one-piece. Um, I do... I specialize because in complicated. Like, if you need, like, a belly pincher or you have arms that are different lengths or mechanical things you need to install in your stuff, I do that. So, mm. I do stuff. <laughs> you do stuff. <laughs> We love that. We love doing stuff. <laughs> wow. Hey, those are some awesome questions, Zach. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. I really well, meant to just ask one question and we go popcorn style and, and go around that way, but you worked it out really good. Thank you. Thank you for having me. I appreciate yeah. it. Yeah, that was a lot. Especially of since I'm not a super cosplayer um so <laughs> i appreciate it well it was neat looking at it from your viewpoint where you're interested in it and and that's that's really really interesting i really appreciate it yeah, Thank you. yeah some of the stuff i was dabbling in is i made this today oh wow <laughs> oh, that's awesome i love yeah. that oh nice yeah, yeah we also did a uh, doctor who one um which I already give it away, but uh, yeah, I just started making some clocks. <laughs> oh, <laughs> like I, I don't have you, anything else to do. I asked you if you can do coins too, can you? Uh, yeah, I've been thinking about how, how to do it. I just it have is. to come up with the, uh, the sizes and, uh, uh, you know, what to put on front and back, you know, but yeah, I can, I can do it. <laughs> it only has to be one-sided. Oh, okay. But yeah, I mean, one side is even easier, so, but uh yeah, I didn't been rolling around in my head about if I want to make a two sided coin or whatever. Okay. And about two in it. the morning, he'll pop up and go, "Oh, I know how to do that." I'll, I'll get with you. <laughs> he's he's the three D print master guru, <laughs> sensei. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I've got uh, an Ahsoka Tano silhouette. It's on the printer right now, and a. Uh, Mandalorian helmet uh, uh, clock. They're printing right at, as we speak. So, <laughs> my printer's sitting on the ground because I needed space to get to my computer. Mm -hmm. I don't think uh, I'll ever. We would be sitting in the floor <laughs> before that would happen. <laughs> <laughs> Well, okay, uh, Zach, do you have any ideas of somebody for next week? Um, ooh, uh, not off the top of my head. No, I do not. Um, I wish I did, but I do not. I, I'm kind of gone um, oh. as far as up front. Um, I'm sure... There's somebody in the 757 who would love to come and talk, um, but I'd have to <laughs> see. Potentially, I don't know, Alan, what Carl's schedule looks like, but maybe Carl would like to come in and do something. Uh, well, we can always ask and find out what's going on. Um, if not, you can always reach back out to me and Daniel, you can do. I may have somebody else that might be able to help fill the shoes, but uh, oh, okay, awesome. 
but uh <clears throat> but yeah we can do uh work something out and uh have somebody to do some speaking and everything okay zach i just sent you a friend request on facebook okay okay yeah i'll make sure i get that answered yeah and, and you can contact me that way or through alan it doesn't matter okay um so yeah that was awesome thank you yeah thank, thank you, you zach